Now let's look at this. How long is the train? 70 meters long. It travels through a tunnel at a constant speed of 15 meters per second. Of course, we know that the trains might slow down a little bit, be faster a little bit, but it's an assumption, okay, that the speed is 15 ms is meter per second, right? Now, what is the length of the tunnel if the entire train takes 1 minute 40 seconds to pass through it? Okay, so do you have an answer? Well, what I'll do is I will look at this 40 Oh, sorry, 1 minute and 40 seconds. I want to change it to seconds first. Okay, so 1 minute is 60 seconds. Don't write 100 seconds, okay? I have students who tell me it's 100 seconds and I give them more homework because they have more time than anybody else, okay? So this is 100 seconds. 1 minute is 60 seconds plus 40 seconds is 100 seconds, okay? Now, um, they say that it's 70 meters long, that's the train, and then they have the speed, and then we look at the tunnel. Now, let me illustrate and draw for you, okay? So, we have a tunnel. So, this is a tunnel, very beautiful tunnel, okay? And then, the train starts where? Well, the train starts here, all right? You imagine it's a transparent train, okay? So, the driver is sitting here, right? And it starts to choo-choo. It goes down, okay, 70 meters, write it down, 70 meters, that's the length of the train. Now, this entire train will just go through, and then you want to know what's the length of the tunnel. Well, a lot of people will say, ah, so simple. You want to know the length of the tunnel? Length means distance, right? So distance, I know, is, remember the triangle, DST, the dog sitting on straight times. Ah, if you don't know why is it, you can go into the link and see, okay? Ah, so DST, right? So I'm looking for distance is speed times time. So oh, I have a speed. The speed is fifth, okay, speed times time, just in case you're lost, okay? So speed is 15, and then the time is 100. Ha ha, ta-da! The answer is 1,500 meters. Is this the final answer? It is not. Okay, let me explain to you why. Now, if the train were to go through the tunnel, you know, you have to make sure that the train comes out, all right? So when the train comes out, change color, okay? You come here. And then this is still the driver, okay? The driver is not on this side, okay? The train goes this way. Driver doesn't change seat, huh? So it goes out this way. So it starts from here, okay? And then you only stop counting here. You understand? Right, so what is this distance? This distance is 1,500 meters. Okay, this is 1,500 meters. Is that what the question is asking for? The question is asking for the length of the tunnel. It's just here that the question wants. Okay, so what should you do with the 1,005? 1,500, you got to minus off the length of the train. As the train walk goes through the tunnel, it will not get shorter, okay? So this is 70 meters. You minus 1,500 minus 70. You have 1,430 meters. That is the length of the tunnel. All right? So this is a common error. When you draw a picture like this, you see it really clearly. So if you want to hear what the story is about the DST, go into our link and you will be able to see it.